everybody. <laughs> What's going on? How you boys doing today? My name is Very, Very Tired and Fat Man. <laughs> Last night was Christmas and we went over to a friend's house and I had like some sort of revelation. I don't think I ever had a Christmas dinner. You know, with the full like turkey and ham and all that. I don't think I, I've actually ever had one. <laughs> I don't know why. I know my mom always tried to do things that was really cool and we always had like some sort of dinner, but I think we always went out or, or like we had, you know, like a steak or something. But it wasn't like, it wasn't like chicken or, or, or turkey or anything crazy like that, ham and whatnot. So last night we went over to a friend's house and it was insane. <laughs> It was insane. It was great. All this food and now I'm paying the price. I am hurting so bad. I ate way too much. Hey, look at that. Oh, baby. So we participated in a thing called uh, Secret Santa. And last episode, I actually did my Secret Santa to Sunfire. Um, and I wonder who got me. And it looks like they left me a present. Merry Squidmas from Secret Santa. I Okay, I'm very... I, I'm very cautious now because I know, I know people like to prank on this server, especially me. Ah! No, there's actually, there is actually something in there. <laughs> I'm like half expecting, oh my good golly gee. <gasps> Cactus poker? <laughs> that, oh my, oh my god. Oh my, okay, we're throwing you away, buddy. You're, you're in the main sword now, baby. And a needle shooter? Oh, oh, you guys, you guys. This is awesome. <gasps> yeah, oh, Christmas cake, gingerbread cookies. Oh, I love gingerbread cookies. Let's take a break real quick and give a true shout out to some gingerbread cookies, okay? <laughs> I love them. Uh, fancy candy, which <laughs> it's watermelon, man. That's fruit. Uh, Christmas pudding, Christmas pudding, and turkey! Oh, right, we're having an actual meal. I'm, I'm, I'm hurting. This is actually painful to talk about because I'm in so much pain right now. I'm hurting. Why would you bring up food? How dare you? <laughs> well, whoever this was, thank you! That's awesome! I guess I kind of missed the memo about Secret Santa. It's supposed to be secret. I put my name on my prank. <laughs> But I appreciate it. Thank you, Secret Santa. This is awesome. A wonderful gift indeed. <laughs> and then I woke up this morning. <laughs> I got a message from Ike that said he left me a present as well. Isn't that just great? Isn't that just fantastic? The server that keeps on giving. We're just going to get gifts left and right. He said he left it for me at my base. So I'm assuming... <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Okay, I gotta get a good view of this. I hope I'm oriented right. I hope this is the front. I'm assuming so, because spawn is that way and everybody comes from this direction right there. So I'm assuming if I climb up to the top here, I'm gonna be able to read what he wrote for me. Um, sick and nasty! <laughs> hey man, that, this is sick nasty. I like that. I actually, I actually really like that. <laughs> I think I want to keep it, but maybe not sick nasty. Maybe I won't put sick nasty. You know what? I like that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, we're leaving that here. <laughs> huh. <laughs> you know, whew, we have fun around here. <laughs> Anyway guys, welcome back to another episode. I think I did this whole bit at the beginning of the episode, but that was like a week ago. I do these things in week time spans. <laughs> so I don't know where I started this episode, but I want to make something today. I need to make a, a proper home. This, guys, come on, this, this is not a proper home. I need to, to clear out a space here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a big old box, a big old behemoth of a boy, uh, kind of just like this, right at this area. The goal being, I want to make like a viewing station, right? Like this is clearly alien. <laughs> I, I'm going to laugh every time I freaking see that sick nasty. <laughs> uh, but this is going to be like the viewing station of the valley. So there's going to be like uh, glass windows from like right over here. 
to over here, and basically it's gonna be scientists and whatnot, and they're gonna be like, what is this alien crap that's spawning in this valley here? So I wanna make like a decent kind of base thing here. I think we could even go out to like right here-ish even. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a clear job, and we're gonna be right back. And there we go! You know, a little bit more room to breathe now. <laughs> I don't like it. I think it's very weirdly shaped and it's kind of awkward, but it'll work for what we want to do. You know, I just want to have a little bit of room to run around in my own place here. I think this is just going to be like the observation deck. And so I think the main build of what I want to do today is going to be out here. Yeah, I think so. So let me grab, I'm just going to use white concrete for the floor, but I'm pretty sure, or not concrete, I'm sorry, we're going to use white terracotta, but I'm pretty sure in the future we're going to be using some white concrete because I really don't like the pink color and I think it matches too well with the um, the, the, the white terracotta that's on the, the lines here in the canyon. And I want this to feel like a very man-made structure. So it's not going to be white terracotta, I can promise you that. But let's go ahead, build a small little platform. Actually, I say small, but I want it to come out to like right, yeah, right here would be fine. And then I'm just going to make... Uh, a, a nice little a viewing observation deck here. So something like this. It's a, it's a little bit off-centered, but I like that it's off-centered. I feel like, you know, in, in a perfect world, or <laughs> in, in a non-perfect world, everything is off-centered anyway, so I think this is going to be perfectly fine for what we have planned. I even have this chest here. So if I use, mm, should I use block? glass blocks or should I use glass panes? I think I'm going to try glass panes at first and if I don't like it from there we can we can move on okay so the next thing I want to do here is I want to line up the the edge of this like this like so all the way around I'm probably going to go up three blocks wide or three blocks tall rather because I want to feel like if you go up to this glass right here you can see the whole entire cactus so let's see here oops where did I put that? Where did that even... Oh, no, it went straight up. Okay, cool. Exactly where I wanted to. Uh, it's just hard to see from this angle. So if I come up straight to the glass, will I be able to see the whole thing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, no, you'll be able to see the whole thing. So I think three tall is going to be perfectly fine. I also want to break all of this because I want to feel like this is part of the room. I don't want it to have this fake wall. Oh, wait, what's happening? Oh, I'm one down. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. We'll work with that. <laughs> but I do want to break this wall so it looks like uh, this is like a whole entire building instead of, um, you know, a wall and then a viewing platform. I think that would be super sick. Also, oh yeah, also, I forgot. I actually, I actually prepared for this. I have this gray terracotta. I didn't want to go with black. I thought gray was going to be a perfect, like, neutral color. So instead of putting it, like, the glass here on the corner... Not, that's not what, that's not what I meant to do. How am I gonna do this? Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna pillar up. This actually makes me think I'm gonna need a way up. Yeah. Oh, what are you guys doing over there? Oh no, we're gonna have to deal with them too. Anyway, let's let's do this like we were planning. Okay, so I'm gonna go up like a pillar here. We could actually break that and put that there. And I'm gonna go up uh, three, and then I'm gonna go up one more. And we're kind of going to do this little number all the way over to the wall, just like this. So it looks like we have like an actual roof here. And I'm going to do this so often. Uh, they're just sitting there just staring at me, okay? We're going to have to do it. I don't have a bucket of milk. We'll get that. We'll get to that. But I can't have these guys just staring at me like this. We're gonna have to pick them off one by one here. Oh my goodness! Now that we got that sorted, <laughs> and those guys are dead skis. I do want to make a way out here. So I think maybe like right here would be a good place to kind of start. Ooh, maybe maybe not. Let's uh let's go like here, right? And this is gonna be a staircase down to the actual uh to the actual canyon and i kind of want to have like an air seal an airlock because this is going to be like alien territory this canyon right that's why the scientists are here to do some studying and whatnot so i want to make it feel like 
to get in and out of it, you have to go through this huge like decontamination process. So I'm gonna have to make some <laughs> airlock doors and whatnot. Uh, I do wanna go one more because I don't like that hitting my head. So maybe something like this. Yeah, 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 I like that, I like that. So that'll be the main entrance in and out of the laboratory. And like I said, we're gonna have to air seal that. But I think this is gonna be pretty cool. So let me go ahead, let me go ahead and get like a uh, temporary form to this. <laughs> and then uh, I'll be right back, I guess. Oh, wee bit of clearing here and there. And this, <laughs> this place is starting to look pretty nifty. I'm kind of happy with it. And like I said, we can come up here. Ooh, and we can just barely see the tippity toppity, but I think that's gonna be fine. I think that's gonna be fine because a lot of the fio flora, flora <laughs> it's gonna be all over down here and i think that's gonna be the center of attraction like yes this cactus is gonna be huge and massive but there's gonna be so much life down here that i think i think three tall is gonna be perfectly fine but i do want to have a second layer of defense so bear with me in my mind right this is an alien territory so I think first things first, these scientists have to be worried about safety, right? So I'm thinking, what if we add a second layer here? Like this is the viewing station. This is like if things are code green, everything's A-OK -okay for right now. But I want to make like a secondary uh, safety wall back here. So like it's it's code red, time to be locked down or whatever. Uh, then they could go ahead and drop these safety walls. And I'm even thinking maybe we could do some redstone stuff, right? We press a button and the safety walls drop up or get put up or something. We could definitely do something like that. I think that'd be super fun. But we got to make these pillars first to kind of tell us where this wall is going to be. And I think this is a perfect area for that secondary wall. It's it's a little bit weird because it's off-centered. There's two pillars over here and one pillar over here. But I, I think, like I said before, that's going to add to the realism aspect of it. I think it's going to look pretty sick nasty. Uh, sick nasty! <laughs> <laughs> that was unintentional, Ike. You you got one point, okay? That's one point for Gryffindor. <laughs> so something along those lines right there. We can work out the redstone uh, mechanics a little bit later. I think what I want to do now, here's the issue. Here's the issue that that is coming up. I don't think I could put panes above, window panes above. But I do want to have a layer of glass so I'm thinking if we put glass like right here, for example, right? Bear with me here, bear with me. And that way we can kind of come up here and see the, the, the tippity top, uh, even though we have four wide or three wide, three tall, I'm never gonna talk right, so don't expect it, okay? So we're gonna come up here, we can be like, oh my goodness, look at this thing, and then we get the full view as we come up. So a little bit of a, a sunroof, if you will. I think I'm gonna do that on all sides here. Um, and then kind of just enclose this area a little bit. But do we need to worry about this? I think we do. We do need to make some sort of airlock system. I just don't have the redstone stuff. You know what I mean? So I think I'm going to go ahead and call it quits today. We got the bare bones. We got the necessities. So I don't want to go ahead and worry about this. I do know, however, that a lot of been, a lot of been work, <laughs> a lot of work has been done over at the, um, the shopping center or the shopping district. So let me go ahead, ditch all this crap in here. We'll come get it later. Um, and then, oh, you know what? I should probably get rid of uh, this omen effect before <laughs> before we go into town, you know, uh, but let's go ahead and head on over there See what they have to offer. I'm hoping they have some more uh, um, Items like uh, gear that we can upgrade to <laughs> Let's cross our fingers. We're gonna have to bring out all our diamonds. Where are our diamonds right there? I'm gonna just pack them all just in case. Oh Man, it has been quite a bit since we have last been here, okay? <laughs> First and foremost, I have to show you this. I would 100% be amiss if I didn't show off this, okay? I don't know if Mantis has shown episodes of this yet, but definitely this <laughs> is, this is so beautiful. I'm in love. I'm just gonna show off everybody's builds, okay? Definitely go watch their episodes because you're gonna wanna see what they've done to get to where we're at now, because it is insane. Look at all this stuff. Buildings are popping up. 
Oh my gosh, it looks like there's plans for more buildings. The spider farm's got a pagoda. Things are, what is, why is there, what, what is this? Why is there another portal on top of the church? It seems a little sinister, I will be honest. <laughs> this, this spawn is getting crazy cool. I love it. I think there needs to be a little bit more of a vertical aspect of it. I think we need to put something in the sky, like right over there to kind of give it a good look. And I'm hearing, I'm hearing that that ghast, I'm going to have to turn him off. I'm going to have to turn him off. <laughs> but maybe some more air balloons. I don't know. Hot air balloons. What are they called? They're called balloons, right? I don't know. Sure. Um, let's go ahead and check our, our shop here. Do we have any sales? Do we have any sales? No sales. No one wants any red sand? Well, boo-hoo. <laughs> uh, pumpkin pie coming soon. Adela, sick. Creeper damage. Okay, cool. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. What do we... We got any new shops in here? I visited the Affable Apothecary. That's really hard to say. But I visited that before. The old tool shop. Hey, guys. I think this is what we're looking for, actually. I think this is 100% what we're looking for. I believe this is Night 13's shop. Uh, let's see. Random enchants, diamond tools, one diamond per t Wow. Okay. Okay. Bear, bear necessities. These seem to be efficiency too. Ooh, nice axe. My axe doesn't have anything on it. I'm really looking for picks. Okay, so that's got efficiency too. That's not as good as mine. Uh, efficiency two. Uh, picks. Four diamonds. Perfect. <gasps> that's it? That's it? Four diamonds? I would expect him to say four diamond blocks, right? Okay, I feel like this is a ripoff. I'm going to go ahead and give you one diamond block, okay? Because because I think you deserve more, okay? I, I would have paid two diamond blocks, but since you only asked for four, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not that crazy, okay? But consider the rest a tip, okay? Consider the nine or the, the five diamonds plus a tip for your services night that's awesome what's this uh with silk touch oh my goodness perfect with silk touch it's got mending and unbreaking on it mine doesn't have those should i do that five diamonds per okay okay yeah i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it okay i'm wasting my diamonds here and i'm gonna give you another tip okay five diamonds extra for tip okay <laughs> there you go <laughs> he's gonna open this up if he doesn't watch this video he's gonna open this up and be like i think somebody misunderstood what i my pricing <laughs> but that's fine night thank you buddy i appreciate that man i think there's more right is there more shops over here no that's just detail i believe yes there's a shop here Ike has claimed this one. Okay, cool. We're going to have to come back when Ike is done with that. What is this? Ion. <laughs> I believe this is going to be... Oh, this is super cool. Oh, is that glass? I was really curious on how she got the water to float like that. That is cool. That is cool. Can you see that from the outside? Oh, I want to see. I bet you you can because it looks like I saw a building from out there. How does this look from up here? <gasps> This is a cool design. We might have to steal this. Oh, that's sick. That is sick. That is really cool. I like that. I, I, okay, if I have to be a stickler, I would say hide this wall right here with some like seaweed or something. You know what I mean? Not seaweed, but like, uh, what, are, what are those? Kelps. Yeah, yeah. Get some kelps, right? And then hide that wall a little bit. But that looks super cool. I'm, I'm excited. Oh my goodness. What are, you, what are you selling though? Iron. Okay. Oh yeah. Iron. That's how Idella says iron. Oh my goodness. She is 64 ingots for two diamonds? Two diamonds? I don't know if I need ingots. No, not that bad. I don't, I don't need ingots, uh, Adela. I, you know, I, I, I don't think, uh, <laughs> I don't think it's necessary for me to have iron ingots. Uh, so I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm actually gonna buy any, you know Do I need iron? What, what's over here? Oh, do I do it? Do, do I need this iron dude? Ah Hmm, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll um, you know, I'll, I'll tell you what I'll come back and I'll think about it if I need the iron, okay? I, I just don't know if it's a good price you know, 64 for two. It seems a little bit of a ripoff for me, you know. <laughs> Run before she realizes I purchased half her stock. <laughs> but 
guys, I am gonna go ahead and call it quits today. I had a lot of fun. I'm glad we finally got to like just the basic designing of our build. I'm really happy with that. I do want to, between now and next episode, I want to start uh, looking for colors and whatnot so we can make more cacti in the in the valley. I also want to deck out the walls a little bit more. Uh, I don't know if you noticed, but I'm trying different colors. So we tried a little bit of a yellow for the, the valley walls. Um, we're going to get there. It's going to look a lot better. But I, I'm, I'm so excited. That's what I'm going to be doing off camera. Where's my bed? So warm and cozy, this bed. You need a more fluffy pillow, though. Are you scared? <laughs> Extra sign. Uh, that might have been there when my bed was there. But I don't know where my... Did he steal my bed? No. I, I, I definitely took my bed. <laughs> anyway, guys, much love. I love you guys to pieces. Thank you for being here. If you're new to the channel, like subscribe even if you're not new how about you you like anyway oh i'm gonna blow stuff up don't worry about it we're fine <laughs> anyway guys much love peace